Hello, um, my name is Stormy and I am 28 years old. I was uh, just diagnosed with colon cancer three days ago. Um, I have two kids, uh, ages two and 11. And um, I am feeling all kinds of ways. Um, one day I'm okay, one day I'm mad angry at the world. Um, uh, one day I'm sad. Um, I basically wanted to um, create this page uh, to share my journey, to show awareness to um, colon cancer. Um, at 20, you don't expect to be diagnosed with cancer at all. Um, But colon cancer is something rarely talked about. Um, in your younger age, they're not telling you to go and uh, get a colonoscopy. They're not advising you to get uh, any of that checked out. Um, they're normally saying, you know, okay, you're 50. It's, it's time for your colonoscopy. Um, but not, not in your 20s, 30s, 40s. They're not saying that. Um, I've been in pain. Uh, lots of pain in the last few months. Hurting severely. Um, been in and out of the ER so many times. Um, begging them, pleading, please do something. Like, keep me overnight. Something's wrong with me. Please, can you move up this colonoscopy? I am hurting. Um, they hand me some uh, antibiotics and some laxatives and uh, give me a shot of pain medicine and they send me on my way. Um, on the 31st, I, uh, it was finally the day, you know, I was gonna get some answers. Um, so I go in, I go for my colonoscopy and, uh, yeah, I wanted some answers, uh, but I didn't want that particular answer. <laughs> um, I'm trying to keep myself in good spirits. I'm trying to, um, get things done. I am trying to keep myself busy, um. I have surgery coming up Tuesday and uh, I don't know how long I'll be in the hospital for. Um, recovery is going to be a challenge um, to say the least. I got two kids I got to worry about. Who's going to get on to this doctor's appointment? Who's going to keep them? Who's going to make sure my daughter gets to gymnastics? Who's going to make sure that, you know, they're taken care of and they're loved? And um, with this COVID stuff going on, like, I'm not going to be able to see my babies for a few days. I'm freaking out. Um, thinking about basically everything that I really shouldn't be thinking about right now. Um, thinking about bills, finances. How am I going to pay my car payment? Um... Um, how light bills do rent. Um, I can't focus to be honest. Um, and anybody in my position would be the same way. You know, I mean, we got things to do. We got like, I ain't got time for this cancer. Like I just don't got time for it. I got things to do. Um, and that's why I wanted to uh, create this group so that um, anyone else 
experiencing this, going through this, has this cancer. Um, I, I want to share awareness. I want to share my experience. I want to share my journey, um, knowledge that I gain, everything um, that I'm about to go through. I know I'm not the only one. I know that there are other people out there that are going to experience this too, um, even in their 20s. <laughs> Um, and so this is the main reason for this page. Um, and, uh, my sisters and my cousin have graciously got together and are helping to, um, try to ease the blow of finances while I fight my fight, while I get through this battle. Um, cause it's going to be tough. And even after surgery, you know, it's, it's, it's not going to be over. I mean, I've got a long way to go. I'm, I'm just getting started here. Um, so they're going to be, uh, you know, selling custom, um, custom made, um, you know, shirts, uh, decals, um, things like that. Um, and, uh, you know, they'll be posted on here. Um, you can order them, re um, requ re request specialized things. Um, it'll be updated frequently. Um, or if you just want to donate, um, a dollar, two dollars, um, at this point, any, anything helps, um, I just want to make sure that um, while I'm here, that my bills, um, my kids, every they're comfortable um, and taken care of, and I I feel that I'm I'm gonna make it through this. But if God decides to um, take me, then I know that um, whatever is left in um in donations or you know um things that people have uh bought whatever money is left that doesn't go to the bills and day-to-day -day living will go to helping um my kids get through the first year or two um of life without me um But I'm going to stay strong for now. Um, I'm not going to let this get me down. I am going to do everything I can to be here and um, continue to be a mom. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. I'm just emotional <laughs> like um, emotions change drastically these days um but uh i just want to um just know just let you guys know that um uh, if you know someone that's going through this or you are going through this that you are not alone and um if you need someone to talk to um if you just want to, you know, um, just follow the page, um, to get information on, um, on this cancer, um, or you just want to know where this journey takes me. Um, I, uh, I appreciate it all, truly. Um, anything that I can do to help um, guide others through this, um, I feel like 
that's what, uh, that's the kind of personality I was given. Um, that's who I am as a person. So, um, just always here to help. And I hope following this page, um, helps you. Um, like I said, feel free to message, comment, um, leave good vibes, prayers. It's all welcomed. Um, and, uh, like I said, I'll update day to day. And, uh, if I don't message you back, um, then someone, someone from my family will, will get back to you. Um, thank you for watching this video and uh, following.